This is an AMI This Week Shortcut. I'm Wade Brown for Accessible Media. Going to hockey games together is a bonding experience for families across Canada. And that is very true for Saskatoon's Jerry Nelson and his 12-year-old son, Wyatt. We have a pretty good relationship, me and, me and Dad. We really connected through sports. He sees himself and me, you know, kind of reliving his childhood again. What makes this family unique is that Jerry is completely blind. They love to go to the Western Hockey League's Saskatoon Blades hockey games. Anything that I can do with my son is just an absolute joy, but there's something about uh, doing it uh, involving hockey. Um, yeah, it, it really brings us close together. One day, something happened that brought these two even closer together. Over the years, uh, you know, if uh, some free tickets came along or something like that, we would just go and most of the time I, I would take a, a radio in my pocket with an earpiece and um, that's how I would listen and it was just an outing. But then uh, this fall, we ended up at a preseason Blades uh, game and there was no radio coverage. And amazingly enough, without even being asked, Wyatt just started to describe the play to me. Lethbridge has it, sends it up, centers it. Lethbridge has it, Blades end. The president of the Saskatoon Blades, Steve Hogel, was at that game and happened to overhear the live description between father and son. I was running around as usual, and then for the third period, I dart up to the top of the stands, and I hear this little boy calling play-by-play, -play, and I'm thinking, man, this kid's really into blades hockey. This is beautiful. The final whistle goes, and, and people start to disperse, and I see this young boy leading his father out with a white cane, and I almost wanted the ball on the spot, and I thought, oh my goodness, that is so powerful, so moving. And what leadership with this little guy to go there and not give a hoot what anybody thinks and call it play-by-play -play for my dad, and we're gonna enjoy this game together. Lethbridge kind of skating around with it. It's back up in front. Wyatt explained how he decides what to describe. Whoever really has the puck is one of the main things However, if there's like a really nice pass or a really nice play or someone gets nailed along the boards, I stop whatever I'm talking about and talk about that for a while. But really, it's more whatever interests me in the game, I will describe to death. Okay, it's kind of a battle for it right now. I mean, I really love it. I really love going to the games with my dad because, you know, we get to talk, hang out, and watch a hockey game. It's like the whole nine yards. Their love of sports was very evident in the room in Jerry's house where we did the interviews. Wyatt explained why the room is so important to him. We're in my man cave. We have pictures, calendars, some medals that my dad has won, trophies that my grandfather has won. We have mini hockey sticks signed, baseballs, hockey cards, everything really to do with sports. I really enjoy, we come up here, you know, late at night and just sit in here. Sometimes we don't even say anything, we j I just look, you know. I love this room. I share everything that I can with my son. Uh, he is absolute my life. There's nothing more important to me in life than my son. The highlight of, um, you know, my time is, is with him. For Accessible Media, from Saskatoon, I'm Wade Brown.